Blueprint APS is Aurora Public Schools' way to plan for the future. As a school district, we want to make sure we're serving the APS community in the best way possible. That takes imagination, great ideas, and our community coming together to plan for the future. Let's face it, Aurora is changing. We're seeing changes in everything from where families are living, to what families tell us they want for the future, and to what their needs are now. As Aurora changes, APS needs to listen to our community and proactively plan for the future. So starting back in 2017, APS focused on empowering community voice, addressing community need, and providing community choice. After two phases full of tons of community input, APS is implementing its community developed plan for the future. It focuses on creating district managed choice programs for students through regional specializations. That means each of these seven regions will have a focus. Perhaps one of them is an arts region. Another, science, technology, engineering, and math, also known as STEM. Maybe even an aerospace region. These specializations are being developed by seven regional design teams full of community members. The teams are collaborating and designing together. It's an exciting process that will allow for so many community members to help shape future programming for APS students. In the future, APS's blueprint also focuses on shifting from neighborhood schools to boundary schools. Currently, there are many Aurora neighborhoods with a lot less school-age children. Shifting to boundary schools allows the district to make better use of its limited resources. So, students may have to travel a little further to their home school. But students will have their pick with magnet specialization schools and more choice options throughout the district. Of course, making all of this a reality will require tough conversations about repurposing some buildings. That means some schools may change in grade configurations or turn into community centers. Some buildings may close. These conversations will be led by our community with the Long Range Facilities Advisory Committee, or LRFAC, serving as the steering committee. Also, moving forward, APS will focus on the P8 model, meaning students stay in the same school from preschool through eighth grade. We've seen more success with P8s, both academically and in terms of discipline. They also tend to build stronger communities since students are at the same school for a longer period of time. <laughs> Remember, Blueprint APS is a long-term planning process, meaning that some changes are still five, or even 10 years down the road from now. It's all about turning our community's dreams into reality. Blueprint APS, empowering community voice, addressing community need, and providing community choice. <laughs>